Both bands were hugely fond of overdubs, massed vocals, you know, I mean, we, we were studio bands essentially, I mean, Queen were lucky enough to have Freddie as a frontman, we didn't really have a frontman as such, we weren't showmen at all. I always describe us as we sounded like 400 maniacs from Hollywood, but looked like four scruffy gits from Manchester, and maybe that's why it didn't quite work as well as it could have done. <laughs> Looking back on that era, bands like Queen and other sort of more literary kind of bands got more recognition or are remembered more because they were more flamboyant than 10CC. 10CC were always a, uh, we were all about the music. Then we were a living, breathing, touring brand with responsibilities and people working for us and we were quite successful, we were doing well. And I remember very distinctly we had a kind of pre-production meeting about what, how dare you might be. And I found it quite a disturbing meeting because it was sort of, it wasn't like, well, let's try a bit of this and let's try a bit of that. It was, well, we need one of those and we need two of those. It was that attempt to quantify who and what we were that I found slightly troubling. It took the freedom away. It took the sense that you could just go in there and try things. The need to be fresh was ever so slightly tarnished in a way. I'm tired, darling. Don't you think you've had enough? It's late. Just a bit more. Okay, Mom? Okay. Now let's fetch the guns and things, said Huck. No, Huck, leave them there. They're just the tricks that we have to go to Robin. We'll keep them there all the time and we'll hold our order. Mom? Mm -hmm. How do you say O R G I E S? What? What are you reading? Tom Sawyer. Oh. Now, how do you say that word? Orgies. Orgies. Just orgies. Now hurry up and finish that page, okay? And we'll hold our orgies. Mom, what's an orgies? Do you remember what I told you about a man and woman being in love and making babies? Yes. Well, an orgy is people doing that without the love that makes it so nice. How come Tom Sawyer's gonna have an orgy? I think he's talking about something the pirates are gonna do. Do you have an orgy, Mom? <laughs> no. <laughs> in fact, your mom hasn't had a lot of anything lately. Mom? Hey, Mom, can I have those balloons? Please? Well, let's get your ass in gear and let's see what you can really do. Guys, Dick can't go back out there.
producer Harriet Henderson announced today that station WMSH wants to get involved in the workout craze that's sweeping North America. They're going to have no <laughs> And they're holding auditions to find a hostess. So? So? You audition for the show. Me? What about Patty? Oh, get serious, me. Move over, Jane Fonda. <laughs> when? Next week. No way. Sam! What's the matter? I refuse to be exploited. Walter Hines, your business manager, has embezzled all of your money and he has left the country. Okay. It can't be! Can't be, David. I'm a wealthy woman, you know? I, I buy what I want. I mean, look at all my stuff. You know, I tip big. If I see a nickel in the street, I don't even stop to pick it up. Does that sound like the behavior of a woman who's broke? <laughs>